When he didn't share the love with me and Pop, I need you some back right now. Get out now. That is what I finally feel. Look at SpongeBob. Well, it was going great until you showed up. What is that? Oh, just a birthday cake for my mom that I spent all day making. Idiot boy. Come on, come on, come on. That's the first time somebody's called me that. Wait, I know who will enjoy my company. Don't you ever wake me from my beauty sleep! Do you understand, idiot boy? Woo -wee! It's all done! My greatest invention yet! Sandy! What a neat robot! You see, I was up in the tree, and I thought it'd be funny if I gave you a surprise. Oh, you gave me a surprise, all right. Look at the surprise I got! Get out of here, idiot boy! <laughs> Mr. Dollar, allow me to introduce you to Mr. If I were you, I'd get as far away from me as possible. Idiot boy! Yeah. Yeah. Thing, if Mr. Krabs is calling me idiot boy, it must be true. I know what must be done. Goodbye, pineapple. <sighs> Goodbye, Squidward. Goodbye, Patrick. Goodbye, Sandy. Goodbye, Bikini Bottom. Goodbye, life as I know it. Welcome to Bikini Bottom. Population 538. Minus one. Idiot boy, idiot boy, idiot boy. Idiot boy, idiot boy, idiot boy, idiot boy. Patrick, where's SpongeBob? I don't know. I've been knocking on his door for three hours. I need his hot sauce for my milkshake. We ain't got time for that. <laughs> Gary? Where are you, little guy? Gary? If you found this letter, that means Gary's food bowl is empty and that it needs to be refilled. It also means it's been approximately one year since I've split town and no one's noticed till now. No one needs to worry. I won't bother anyone again. Sincerely, SpongeBob, a.k.a. Idiot Boy. Stella, I'm so sorry for not sharing your lemon. I am so sorry for calling you an Aunt Burn. Can you share stuff next time? Yes, I will.
<laughs> you will? Great! The end.